Jamal Finkley, Black Tree TV. Hi, Edwin. Hi, hi Chris. How y'all doing? Good, hey, Jamal. How, how you are doing? you? So, so, Chris, I mean, it seems like most of your movies now, you're saving the world. I wonder, like, do you ever get tired of saving the world? Do you want to, like, destroy the <laughs> world or something? <laughs> oh, yeah. Tough problem to have. Uh, we are very lucky that we get paid to play for a living. And I think it's athletes, actors, and musicians. You know, it's a fun thing. And I've been fighting imaginary monsters with imaginary guns my whole life. And now I'm getting paid to do it. So uh, I consider myself very blessed. Edwin, I, I've been, you know, I've been following you and, and your brother's career for a long time. And I was so uh, excited to see that you guys are about to be producing um, Parallel Forest. I mean, that's yeah. a great film. And like, how excited are you to like go from uh, in front of the camera where we've been seeing you the most to now, you know, writing, producing and having your own film coming out? Um, you know, it's, it's, it's all part of our, our evolution, you, you know, um, it, it's something that we've, we've worked forward to, we've looked forward to, to working together uh, in a creative capacity. And, um, you know, well, I was fortunate last year to have this, this project kind of, you know, stumble, stumble into it. And initially, we were just brought on to, to be actors. And uh, somehow I, I ended up uh, turning into one of the writers along with my brother, um, our, our boy, Jonathan Kesey. And uh, yeah, now, now, now we're producing this thing. It's a different hat. And, um, you know, I, I hope I can uh, carry as, as much grace into it as, as my man here, you know, wearing that hat as well. So I'm uh, definitely excited for this new turn in our, our 50 to 60 armed men and women standing on the pitch. You tapped in. Good copy. It's okay. We are you. 30 years in the future. It's okay, sweetie. We are fighting a war. Our enemy is not human. And we are losing. In 11 months' time, all human beings in the future will be wiped from the face of the earth unless you help us. So I know in Tomorrow War, you guys go to the future, try to prevent a war um, that, that's happening in the future. If we could go back to yesterday, to the past, like what would be something that we wish there was like a, a past force that would erase something before we are where we are today with it. I mean, you, you, could you think of something that we wish we would have had tomorrow for, more for yesterday, that we could have ended something today? Uh, not to get too deep, but hell, I mean, I wish we could erase racism. <laughs> like, it, it'll be as simple as that for me. You, you know, I, I feel we'd be in a much better place if, uh, you know, we can all really true some, or truly find some type of common ground to, to exist in, you know. Um, yeah, we get rid of that. I think we solve a lot of problems. Yeah, I mean, it's it's interesting that dilemma. Thinking like, if we could go back and change things, what would we change? And and imagining the world in that changed world, what would it look like? Yeah. And and you know, it's hard. We can't do it. We can't do it. It's it's a hypothetical that doesn't exist. However, there's going to be a moment that 2021, June 5th, or whatever day it is today, 2021, is going to be 10 years in the past. And what would, so the better question is not to ask ourselves this now, it's to ask our 10 years from now selves yeah. this, and ask ourselves, what can we do right now yeah. in this exact moment, exactly. the moment over which we do have control? How can we, what can we do? What change can we make now to prevent what some imminent regret 10 years from now? If you think, yeah. if you just put an ounce of that into every day of thinking, you might, we might convince people to act differently, you well know? Said. Well said. I hear that. Well, as long as I have you two guys on my team, I feel like we'll, we'll, we'll win whatever it is 10 years from now. So, oh, let's yeah, go. for sure. I'm, I'm on y'all team. Sure. I'm on, I'm on. <laughs> <laughs> so, I appreciate the time. Always love you guys on, on screen and, and respect you guys off screen. So, keep on doing what y'all do. We'll keep on uh, cheering you on.
Sounds good. Thank, thank you. you. God bless you.